Hey y'all, come follow along with me for the week as I show my diet and how I'm preparing for the 2024 season. Let's go. y'all since we don't got a train today we're gonna keep it real simple and do a chicken avocado bacon sandwich and then some fruit and yogurt on the side all right made four eggs salmon toast avocado and fruit and yogurt one time i was in new york and i paid 35 dollars for this exact same thing maybe cost me like 10 bucks to make all right y'all so it's sunday night tomorrow monday first day of the training week gonna be probably the hardest volume day got 95 second runs 65 second runs so i'm gonna make sure to fuel right i'm gonna eat pasta ground turkey and sweet potatoes and i'm gonna mix in some spinach in there I'm gonna cut the sweet potato into french fry looking slices now i'm putting this in the air fryer water to a boil put a little bit of olive oil garlic powder Sweet potatoes looking good. Turkey's cooking. I'm gonna go ahead and season it up a little bit and then put the marinara sauce on. Perfect. It's about to carry me through that workout tomorrow. Got lunch for tomorrow. All right, so breakfast today, it's Monday. We're gonna do four eggs, turkey, bacon, toast, and a little bit of fruit. Just trying to get some protein in before the workout. Breakfast complete. About to eat it and then head over to practice. We got lunch, post practice. And we're gonna make a little smoothie too. Gonna add some almond milk and some yogurt. Man, get out of there. Some chia seeds. What the dog doing? That's good. All right, y'all, so we're making chicken avocado wraps with bell peppers and tomatoes, and that's gonna get us right for practice tomorrow, so let's get into it. All right, so I'm gonna slice these chickens in, in half. So we're gonna use olive oil and our seasonings here. Seasoned up, let's put it in the air fryer. One cup of brown rice with two and a fourth cup of water. I'm gonna cook these with some olive oil and seasoning. Wash the veggies, we're gonna cut them up. Chicken shaped out pretty good. We got the bread in at 400 for a couple minutes. So here's everything we got. Now we'll put one of these sandwiches together. Looking good. Got a lot left, so obviously. Got weights after practice tomorrow, so it'll be a good post-practice protein. Boom, so we're gonna have lunch for the next couple of days. Put you right here. It's Tuesday, got another tough workout today, so gotta fuel up. Got four eggs, two pieces of toast, and two pieces of turkey bacon with some spinach. For snacks, I'm gonna pack this peanut butter and honey in between practice and weights. I just finished practice, and this is the worst sandwich I've ever had. But I'm gonna eat it. Post workout, finally back from practice, and it's time to eat. I had a disappointing day on the bench press. Haven't done it in like five years, so I got laughed at. But we're gonna get the protein up and we're gonna be we're gonna be back on the bench press soon. Alright y'all, so we got tomorrow off for recovery. Gonna do some pool work and stuff like that. But tonight I'm gonna be making salmon bites in the air fryer and broccoli and rice. Alright, so I'm gonna start with cutting the salmon into bites. I'm gonna add some olive oil and some garlic powder, onion powder, pepper, and some of this wood fire garlic seasoning. A drizzle of honey in here. I, I really don't know why. It probably won't even do that much. It just makes me feel like a chef or something. Broccoli, of course, is easy. I'm gonna put it in this pan that I picked out, which was way too big, with nature's seasoning and pepper. This is real good on vegetables. Yeah, no, it looks good. I mean, the skin threw me off for a second, but I'm just gonna peel that off probably. Here's the final product. Bro, I be putting this on everything too. I just like hot sauce. That's one of my weird things. I go through these like real quick. All right, this is one of my favorite meals I made this whole week and it only took me 10 minutes. And by the way, the honey did do something. It gave it a little aftertaste. Glad I tried that out. And since it only took me 10 minutes, I was feeling myself. So I made a little mixed berry smoothie with some Greek yogurt. It's gonna be a good recovery day tomorrow. 
Since it's recovery day and I'm just gonna be hopping in the pool later to do some drills, I had a little bit more time to A, sleep in and B, prepare breakfast. So I got some eggs and chicken and some peas on the side to get me, get me right before my pool workout. I wouldn't do it for the workout, but I'll do it for the vlog. Just finished the swim. Pool was way too cold, but we did it. Now we got lunch, salmon bites and broccoli. So let's eat up. All right, y'all, so it's Wednesday night and tomorrow we probably got the hardest workout I've had in the last month. But tonight I'm gonna prepare some pasta, shrimp and broccoli to get me ready for tomorrow. I'm just gonna put these in with some olive oil and some seasoning. I haven't tried it in the air fryer yet, but we are gonna see. We got the shrimp going. This stuff is fire. Put some spice on it and some garlic powder. Let's see. No, that looks pretty good actually. Looks smoky. Man, I'm gonna lie, this is hitting way better than when I put it on the on the little hot plate yesterday. It was better to me. I added some of this pesto too to give it a good feel with the pasta. See if the pasta's ready. This is the classic test. It sticks, it's ready. Money. I mean, you go to a restaurant and they're gonna charge you like 25, 30 bucks for something like this. I low key got hungry again, so I made some fruit and yogurt. That'll be dessert. Looking good. The rice and beans did not take that long to make, and the shrimp was from last night. So it's a quick little lunch after a four hour workout. I'm gonna go ahead and make a smoothie too, because I'm hungry and I need some more fruit. We got mixed berries and bananas and chia seeds and some Greek yogurt. We had a hard day today. I mean, we had like three 30 second runs, three 35 second runs, three 40 second runs with not a lot of rest. Um, and then we had weights. So need to refuel after that. Weight room went good. All my homies hate incline bench press. I feel myself getting better every day, getting stronger. All right y'all, so after a tough day today, we're gonna go with the high protein ground turkey, quinoa, and sweet potato bowl to get us ready for the workout tomorrow. I'm gonna put a cup of quinoa in the rice cooker. Chop up the sweet potatoes. I'm gonna do it into circles this time just to change things up. Here's some olive oil. Now I'm gonna put some seasoning in there and then pop it in the air fryer. Starting the ground turkey now. Obviously we're gonna season it later, but just put it on with some olive oil. It looked pretty good. Oh, they're hot. But I'm gonna put it in for a couple more minutes. All right, so this is the seasoning I'm gonna go ahead and use on the turkey. It's done cooking now. I got it on simmer. I'm gonna put some avocados on it too, but these are perfect. So I had to show them real quick. Had to flex these. My step gonna brush them if I press the button. They probably cooked all the way through now. It's probably a little bit better. Secret sauce. All right, y'all. So this is looking good. Good all around dinner, good protein. Super excited for the workout tomorrow. We got 45 second runs today. So I'm gonna go with four eggs, salmon, avocado, and we're gonna do some sourdough toast. I made this pan too hot. This really probably took me like 10 minutes max to make. And there we go. That's good fuel for the workout today. Wish me luck. Making a peanut butter and honey sandwich for post-practice. I like this peanut butter because it's only got peanuts and sea salt. Get that protein in. So we finished with practice, about to eat my lunch. All right, so we got hills tomorrow. We're gonna do lemon pepper, chicken, broccoli, and quinoa. All I gotta do is flip this to cook, wait about 30 minutes, and I'll be ready. I cut these chicken tenders. Got the season with some olive oil, onion powder, lemon pepper, and garlic powder. I'm gonna put this in the air fryer. Broccoli's looking good. Quinoa first. Get some chicken. Dinner is served. I'm gonna kill them hills tomorrow. All right, y'all, so it's Saturday morning. We got hills today. Hard workout, but also marks the end of a great training week. So we're gonna get some eggs and toast and bacon in. That's a wrap on training for the week. Hills took me out, but we got better today for sure. So now we're gonna eat lunch. Uh, we got chicken from last night. All right, we're gonna make homemade pizza with prosciutto, banana peppers, marinara sauce, and cheese. I'm putting some butter on the bottom. Let me put the sauce on now, like a true chef. We also have a special guest today. 
you know, pizza date night. All right, next we're gonna do the cheese. Now that we did that, good source of protein and it tastes good. I'm gonna load mine up with some banana peppers. All right, next I'm gonna put some cubed up chicken for extra protein and boom, got some healthy pizza. <laughs> All right. Five minutes later, we ready. It looks good. Let's see how it tastes. Good pizza. Mm -hmm. Almond milk, fruit, yogurt. Yum. <laughs> Delicious smoothie bowl dessert.